guys welcome back to my channel um so it's been like nearly a year since i've made a studio vlog and uh yeah a lot has changed since the last time you saw me um last time you saw me i was living in bunbury which is over on, on the other side of the country western australia under perth and yeah i was going through a lot and i was just in a really dark place and really miserable and just really like dead inside i don't know how to explain it because there's so much to it so just like in a nutshell i knew i had to make a change and i did i made a drastic change um i became a single mother and a single mother of four so you know that's a lot um and i didn't want to stay where i was because i just wanted to like start fresh so the plan was to move back to new zealand um so i like packed up my whole life like packed me and all the kids stuff into five suitcases sold everything sold up um, and moved to my parents in Adelaide so I was supposed to be there for a little while for like a month or two um, just to get back on my feet and make the move back to New Zealand but then COVID hit and then I don't know things changed I ended up at my parents for like six seven months which was a big deal for me because I'm usually quite an independent person um, but obviously I needed the emotional financial whatever support during that really yucky time of my life so I was there for a while um, I fully made plans to go back to New Zealand like I even bought a car back there um, and it just didn't work out I guess it wasn't meant to be um, I still didn't want to live there in Adelaide like I didn't want to settle there I knew that I wasn't going to be there long term but I also knew I wasn't going to go back to Perth and um, New Zealand still wasn't really an option so I ended up moving to Queensland to the Gold Coast because my sister's here she had been kind of nagging at me for about a year like you should move here and I was like mm, I don't want to move there but yeah I was just ready to like make a change start a new life um, but yeah, I'm happy again. I don't I don't remember the last time I was just like genuinely happy as a person. Like I just felt so I don't know how to explain it, but I was just in a really dark place for a really long time. And making that move was definitely the best decision I've ever made for me and my children. Um so yeah, we're honestly like living our best lives right now. The Gold Coast, it's so beautiful, we love it. They love their new school, they love ju just like the whole move over here. It's been so good for us. And um, yeah, I'm just getting started now. Um, getting my business back up and running. I've actually had my website open for a couple months now, but um, I don't know, I just haven't vlogged about it yet. Uh, I discovered TikTok this year in 2020 so I've been over there making a bit of things just for fun um yeah and a couple of my videos have done way better than I thought they would like I did a video doing my hair routine and it just like I don't know why but it did it yeah it was really cool and I've just been like sharing little daily vlogs of like behind the scenes of my life and things like that but I still really wanted to just get back into YouTube because I enjoy watching YouTube and I enjoy watching you know the behind the scenes of people's whatever and yeah so here I am coming back to YouTube so I thought I'd just do a quick little update um, of where I'm at now so we're in the Gold Coast I don't I don't think we'll be going to um, New Zealand anytime soon I have someone very special in my life yeah, anyway, um, I'm happy. Me and the kids are happy. They, they're they loving our new lives. It's so cool. It's so fun. I didn't know that life could be... this good and positive and enjoyable. Like, I was just so used to... I had become numb to... I don't even know what I'm trying to say. 
but I know I'm a completely different person now and it's great and I have some exciting things to show you so I'll just cut to a video I filmed last night but I couldn't wait to open it today because you'll see if there's background noise or if the lighting's bad sorry it's night time now but I'm just so excited okay so I've been waiting for over two months for these since like first um, making contact and then like planning them like you know just from start to finish it's been like over a two month process so this has been a long time coming I'm so excited <laughs> Okay, I'm actually, I think my heart's racing. I've always wanted these and I eventually want all my illustrations as this. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Alright, so there's two designs. These are keychains. So to start with, I did my most popular um, moldy print, which was Grace. So these are Grace. Oh, okay, so what's happening? Hang on, let me figure out what's happening. So these all have backing cards. So it's got the, I'll show you a close up, but it's got the keychain, I mean the enamel, whatever, and the keychain and the backing card and just by Juanita. I designed the back of the backing card. I don't know why that's not on there. That's, oh man. I'm really sad about that because I fully designed the back of them as well. That's disappointing. That's not on there, but oh my goodness, I still love them. I obviously still love them. Oh, okay. So these are imperfect. Oh, I forgot. There's, you can't see because it's covered, but I got my logo on the back. Okay. Well, wow. I'm all over the place at the moment. I'm just sorry. Okay. I love them. It's so cool. I didn't know how detailed I could do it because Yeah, I've never done any enamel products before, so I didn't know Yeah, how detailed I could do it, but these look so good. Look at it! Look at the glitter behind her. Look at the detail. I don't know if you can see the muck on her chin clearly. I can't tell if it's fuzzy or not, but how good is it? And this one, the writing, it turned out so good. I thought it might be too small, but it's not. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. I have these cute little... Oh! I have these cute little crates that I got specifically for these because I knew they were going to be super cute and I eventually want to just stack up heaps of different keyring designs, so yeah! Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. Oh my goodness, imagine when I have like 10 of these in a row. They look so cute. Yeah, so the key rings, they're so cool. 
I'm so excited I have those. Uh, so right now I need to take some photos of them to add to my website because I did do like a little sneak peek on my Instagram stories last night and I got so many replies and I was not expecting that and I was like crap maybe I should have had the listing already ready so then I could be like go buy them now but I honestly didn't think the response would be that good so thank you guys I gotta take photos now so I can put them on my website oh I also wanted to show you something it's so cute okay so firstly um, I ordered this heat press this Cricut heat press to make these banners and you know just to make clothes and whatever I just wanted to have one um, for my business to invest in and to eventually expand my product range um, so I've been making these little banners they're so cute I love them I'm obsessed when I press them on the front they that press like obviously covers this whole thing because it's quite big and then when I do the little I'll show you I've got these little like watermark rainbow things that I put on the back just as like a the little whatever you know just to show it's from me um, and when I do it with that it would leave like a big line and if I accidentally touched this part of it for too long it would like be too hot and then it would start shriveling up and it would just I don't know it was it worked but it was annoying like I'd rather figure out a way to make it easier so I ordered this oh, it's so cute I haven't used it yet I just opened the box um, when it got here but it's a little mini version of the easy press so it'll just make it easier to do the smaller details of things so I can do the little watermark stamp thingy on the back here without wrecking the front because then I was like just trying to do these little things first while this was still blank and then I'd make this and then because that would be covering the whole thing it would be like this it would be the second round for this little thing getting hot again and it would just you know go ugly so yeah I'm excited to have this and because that one's so big and fat I thought this was so cute so they both come with a little stand and look at the little stand that this one gets to sit in on the desk it's so cute so I need to take photos of these for my website how cool are they I bought some cardstock because I have my art prints in these crates I'm just trying to work on how to make the storage as simple as possible and at the same time like when I'm packing a whole bunch of orders it's not going to be time consuming I'm trying to sift through all the different prints and things that I have so I decided that I would have these for the A5 prints and they'll be standing up like this but I've got this card stock and then have the SKU numbers um, at the top like a little filing system so there'll be tabs at the top and then I can easily just go straight to what the print is because at the moment I think I've got like 70 illustrations on my website and I'm slowly narrowing it down I'm just really trying to clean things up and make everything flow a lot nicer and yes and then I have this bigger crate so this is the A4 print I've been on the road, but never moving alone. Scraping from the bottom, but aiming right at the throne. If I'm always with my brothers, then me, no be right at home. If they gotta take a trip at the area, that's a go see. Mm -hmm. Where's the mail? We got paid up. Me and Wilson still be stacking paper. Putting the party and pay a waiter. Flipping the vest and I taking pay cuts. Sleeping on Vino, it's time to wake up. Whoa, they don't got loyalty, I do. Swear I take a bullet for a night, too. That's my own, so that's my crew. That's my brother, my brother, my brother. My brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, my brother, 
my brother, my brother, my brother. That's my brother, my brother, my brother. 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 My brother, my brother, I can't sell this one because I think I left it under the heat for too long and it started like shriveling up over there. So this is just one for my bedroom. That's my bullshit, that's my bullshit, that's my boy. I got a hit it like killer, he run a business. Jada extra muscle, you know that he running with us. Shot T and Della, the trio, you yeah, the realest. Diggy run the game, you ready, you running with us. I don't really care if you is or you ain't on. I've been running bars this hard since crayon. I don't really spit, but when I do, yeah, I rain on. Bullets come. It just went really dark all of a sudden. The storm's about to come, so I need to go pick up the kids from school because they can't walk in the rain. I thought it was going to be sunny for their walk home, but I have to go. Look how pretty it is. Look at my view. This is one reason why I'm obsessed with where we're living right now. So beautiful. But yeah. I'll give you an update on my storage. You'll see it soon. But um, yeah, I'm going to go get the kids and then I'm going to edit the keyrings and add them to my website. And I'll see you when I see you. Ah, I just added my keychains to the website a few minutes ago and I've already had a couple of orders. So I'm really excited. Um, the weather, it just got so much worse. Like it's so dark and dumb outside but the photos for the website they turned out pretty good considering how dark and depressing it looks right now I just took them on my phone and then I edited them in visco cam and they turned out pretty good look I'll show you that was the before and then that's the after so it looks pretty decent I'm happy with how they came out there they are Look at you. Cute. I love them. I've been on the road, but never moving alone. Scrape it from the bottom, but aim it right at the door. If I'm always with my brothers, then Vino be right at home. If they gotta take a trip at the area, that's a go say. Mm -hmm. Where's the mail? We got paid up. Me and Mokus will be stacking paper, put on the party and pay your way. Holy moly, that took the whole day. So, um, as you can see, I've got one to six. It's in multiples of six. And it goes up to 65. So I have. The mouldy and the non mouldy prints, these are all the A5s, and there are 65 different illustrations to choose from on my website. I'm thinking about narrowing it down a little bit, but um, yeah, at the moment, that's everything. So that's the A5s done. Next, I need to do the A4s and the A3s. Also, um, I've had a handful of orders for the key rings. I think I'll wrap that up for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye! No, I'm not